Tesla stock is down almost 60% from its peak. So has the time come to buy as it looks like a sale to me? But there are others who think this downward trend has just begun. So let me spell out my perspective. Hi, my name is Sunny and a quick like share alongside smashing that like button will be highly appreciated. No doubt how you see it, Tesla stock is on sale. From a 52-week high of $318, it went down to a low of almost $100, which looks like a steal in hindsight. At $165 on the day of recording, it went down 60% from its all-time high. We all remember when it had a trillion dollar valuation that made Elon the richest man on planet. As a matter of fact, Tesla has been a very volatile stock throughout its existence, but there are many reasons that brought about such a heavy discount on its stock price. The company and its business model remains robust as ever. The fact remains, Production is up quarter on quarter as the rate of their growth remains robust. Even after fall in their margins in Q1, they are still making over 20% automotive margins which is close to double than its next big competitor. They have been making record profits which are seeing a healthy jump every quarter in spite of multiple price cuts this year. Now what does this basic data tells you? Business is good then you would ask why stock is going south. One of the reasons is human psychology behind investing. There are two major factors that make a successful business, demand and pricing power. Look at Apple. Their cell phones are more expensive than an average laptop but still can sell in record numbers. Similarly, Tesla always had a wait list that proves customer loyalty Lately, this waitlist was reduced as they build up more capacity where rate hikes also played a part. That is where pricing power comes into effect, where they reduce their prices worldwide to pent up demand while still enjoying close to 20% automotive margins in Q1. Before jumping to any conclusion, let's see why Tesla is different from other automakers. Being a pioneer gave them a first mover advantage because EVs were never mainstream before. That gave them an awesome brand recognition to start with as others are just trying to catch up. Their cars collect more miles of real-time data to feed their FST algorithm which is a high margin recurring income. Tesla has four operational plants and people are talking about a possible new one in Mexico. As compared to last year's sale of 1.3 million cars that they are targeting almost 1.6 million this year which is an explosive growth by any stretch of imagination. There are multiple reasons why Tesla stock is down but nobody wants to dig deeper. Fact remains, Elon was exercising his options which otherwise would have expired worthless and finally his Tesla shareholding went up after that. Secondly, rapid rate hikes by the Fed destroyed demand where the goal was to control inflation. Consequently, all assets including stocks lost value and Tesla was no exception. But they are able to increase demand by adjusting their price which reduced their margins that remain over 20%. All this news put an additional psychological selling pressure on the stock which might offer a buying opportunity for a long-term investor but with a right risk tolerance. Stock investing has two components, fundamental analysis and the most important human psychology behind investing. Therefore, when prices go down, psychologically people panic and sell what they bought thinking they were going to hold for a long term. When there is a panic and everything is selling for a discount, you are basically selling low. On the flip side, you buy during boom cycle at a higher price, but then people say it's hard to make money in stocks. Don't you think people buy and sell at the wrong time and for wrong reasons? The basic rule of investing is buy low and sell high while keeping a lid on your human emotions while investing.
I believe Tesla's business plan alongside their technological lead will enable them to dominate the auto industry for a long time. Ask yourself, will you be able to buy Tesla at $165 range in a couple of years down the line? The answer is possibly no. Don't get me wrong, it can still go down more, who knows, welcome to the world of stock investing. Often fortunes are built during times of panic, therefore why would I wait till they grow big and then I start buying? The logic step is to buy now in small increments and let them execute their well thought out plan. But that is me, I might be wrong. As a disclaimer, I'm not a financial advisor, please consult one before investing based on your personal financial situation. If you like the content that I make, please help me and my channel by liking, sharing and subscribing to it. Thanks for watching and see you in the next one.